The next step is identifying our core values. So we go to Live Setup 2, write your core values. Here you will have two page. First, we go to list your personal values, where you will find a lot of ideas for values, but you can also create your own. So let's just start by creating a new one. If you press the blank value, you can just write a new value like, I don't know, love. We have love, but just an example. And as you can see, it will be added to this database under list your own values. Okay, let's just delete this. But you can also use the idea bucket. And here you have around 100 values. And all you have to do is just click on every single value that resonates with you. So let's see, positive mindset, rest, modesty as you can see it will be added here right now i'm gonna delete these as i selected a couple of values before okay so that you can see on the next step what you have to do so here all you have to do to list all the values that resonates with you that is important to you so don't count it can be as many as you want everything that is important to you just click on the button create new ones and list your values. After you've done that, then go back and go to group and determine your personal core values. Okay, on this page, you will see all the listed values here and you have to categorize them based on central theme. So as you can see, I listed a couple of them so that I can come with an example. So for example, here, the community, friends and family and love are related to each other. Then continuous learning, intelligence, education, growth is, is also uh, a category. Then spirituality, positive mindset, another one, wealth and freedom, another one. Let's create a new category, self-love, family, no family, we already added that, sorry for that, self-respect is another one, let's just delete this, and the new group, sincerity, honesty, and congruence. Okay, so now I have like six categories and now I name the categories based on the content. So for example, this, let's name this friends and family. Okay, this I will say growth, so this is important. is positivity, say it like this. This for me is freedom. So wealth is not as important as freedom. I want wealth to have freedom. So this is why I named it freedom. Let's see, self love and honesty. Okay, and after you named all of these categories, you have your personal core values, the values that are the most important for you. Okay, and now you can add it here. So friends and family, growth, positivity, Freedom, self love, honesty. Okay, and now you should rank based on importance. So you know what is the most important core value of yours. And if you want, you also have a bonus. So you can score 
how good are you at those core values? So maybe friends and family is important to you, but you are not keeping in touch with your friends and, and your, with your family. So you maybe you should improve on that. Okay, and one more step that you can do is to use my Canva template that you have a link here to create a nice image for your core values. So you can create beautiful views after. So you can see in your dashboard, for example, all your core values nicely designed. Okay. And if you've done that, then we are ready to move on to the next step.